What is up guys, Holder here, welcome back to more Fire Emblem Three Houses Cindered Shadows DLC. I figured I might as well start everyone at the title screen, as long as something's popping up, I might as well show, hey, after you get to this point, you get this. And currently, I thought they mentioned we could recruit them after chapter one. Maybe you can meet them after, or after chapter two in the story, but you know, after chapter one and beating chapter one, you know what I mean? Um, but now it says I can specifically recruit Constance in part one, and that's it. Okay, so Constance specifically is tied to chapter two. All right, well, uh, let's go ahead and get into chapter three. I'm really excited to see what unlocks after you beat it. Cindered Shadows, the Rite of Rising. Ah, Professor. To what do I owe this pleasure? Oh, before I forget, there are a few things. Last episode um, was a really stressful chapter. Uh, kind of coming out of the gates real real strong here. Um, but it was the illusion. So uh, I wanted to know if there was actually a way you could end the chapter early. Um, and you, you actually can't. So it was just the illusion of, hey, kill them fast before more come. No, it won't matter when you kill all, the, all of them. Or will come until you have all three and Death Knight. Um, and then the conditions will change. Um, also, there was a change. So the girls I went over last episode were based on um, the initial data mine before the DLC was actually in the game. Um, and there was one discrepancy that they changed between then and now. They updated Yuri's growths. So now, uh, the changes, hold on, I have it over here. So instead of a 35 strength growth, he has a 40. Uh, a, his dex growth of 50 went down to 40, which, uh, okay, okay, balancing out. Uh, his speed growth, <laughs> while it was already 60, is now 65, which I think is the highest speed growth in the game, which is insane. Um, his res growth went from 30 to 35, so we got an inc increase there. And his charm went down from 55 to 50. So he got a buff to strength, buff to speed, buff to res, and a 5% nerf to dex and charm from the things that we thought we knew before. So, small thing to touch on. Uh, I want to hear more about my parents. Ah, yes, of course you do. I will gladly tell you all that I know. Where to begin? If you have something particular in mind, Please ask, and I shall answer as best I can. Tell me about my mother. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is a person we know, like, nothing about. Kind and wise. I would often see her in the library, her nose always buried in a book. What was my father like? That Gerald didn't really do much. <laughs> very much then as he is now. His knights would have done just about anything for him. Okay, so that place is where this is in the story. Like, clearly we're before the time skip, but we are even before Geralt has made his demise. Okay. Whenever he had time to spare, he would instruct the children of the monastery in combat and tactics. Just like those wide-eyed youngsters, your mother and I made a hero of him in our minds. When I learned that Geralt and Citri were to be married, I was quite surprised. Citri? I don't think... There's been a name put to Byleth's mom so far. At least not in any of the bits of Three Houses I've played. Back then, Gerald was something of a mentor to me. As for Citri, she found it difficult to express her emotions. It was only when she was gazing at Gerald that I ever saw her smile. A smile that rivaled the very sun. So maybe... <laughs> Maybe the fact that we're so catatonic isn't because we don't have a heart. It's because our mom was also catatonic. His tales of the outside world must have seemed like a lifeline for one as frail and guarded as she. Frail? Indeed, she lacked the strength to travel beyond the monastery. The only souls she ever spoke with were a select few within the monastery walls. I can picture it now. The stories he told her. His striking words and his boisterous laugh. Listening to him must have given her a great deal of hope. 
As for me, I could never have become like Gerald, as much as I wished for it. You wanted to be like him? I suppose I did. He would tell stories from a century ago as though he had lived them himself. No matter how fervently one studies the stories of old, that is no easy task. Professor, you traveled with Gerald before coming here. You must have seen a great many things, yes? Forgive me for overstepping, but do you not regret foregoing your travels to take up residence here? The Archbishop requests my service. I enjoy my work here. <laughs> well then, I suppose I have no choice but to assist you as best I can. To shape young minds must afford you a unique perspective on the world. I am certain my unsolicited advice is nothing but a nuisance, but please, hear me out. It is my hope that you will live a full life, experiencing the world, fostering strong relationships with people. Do so for dear Citri, whose wish to experience such things shall regretfully never be granted. So you asked me to teach the Ashen Wolves? I cannot deny it. It is my own stubborn notion, one that her grace will likely not think kindly of. Beyond my personal motive, I believe that you alone can guide my flock to even greater heights. And perhaps you will learn from them as well. Ah, but I have taken enough of your precious time. Know that I am here for you. Always. I still feel like I shouldn't trust him. Something about him. I mean, on top of him being linked with the church. Pray tell, Yuri. Uh. Did those foul bandits whom we bested at the arena confess to anything? Not a word. And they wouldn't name names. I got the feeling they didn't know much themselves. However, one thing is clear. Whoever hired them is after something here in Abyss. Yeah, that's gotta be it. They must have been on a treasure hunt or something. A treasure hunt here? I don't get it. What is there to find in these dingy tunnels? Elfric, was it? Looks like this is ringing a bell for you. Well, something does come to mind. But the notion is preposterous at best. Never discount a wild hunch. Sometimes they're closer to the truth than you'd think. Any lead will do, so long as it helps determine our next course of action. Please, go on. As you wish. Though, again, it is quite far-fetched. You see, there is a long-standing legend here. It is said that deep underground, below even abyss, is a place called the Chasm of the Bound, Wherein lies the chalice of beginnings. Ah. Uh, -huh. uh, the chasm of the bound? Huh. This is the first I've heard of it. So you believe Abyss is connected to that place? Lots of twists and turns down here, so it's not the craziest idea ever. Must be well hidden, though. I once happened upon an old document that mentioned a ritual called the Rite of Rising. The text was incomplete, so I was unable to achieve a full understanding of the topic. I cannot even guarantee the authenticity of what I read. But it stated that the Chalice of Beginnings is a sacred object, crafted by order of Saint Seros herself. Saint Seros apparently used the artifact to carry out the Rite of Rising, along with the Four Apostles. The Four Apostles, uh, let's say, what is the Rite of Rising? It is a ritual that is believed to have the power to resurrect a life that was lost. However, the ritual failed. The four apostles bound the chalice, so that it would never fall into a mortal's hands. The rite of rising, huh? Hmm. Ah, oh, yes! The chalice of legend! My father mentioned it to me a very long time ago. A secret treasure of the church. A chalice. Powerful enough to resurrect the dead! Exhilarating, no? Quite. It is no small wonder that people are after it. Even so, we still don't have much to go on. We must gather more information about this legend at once. I wholeheartedly agree. I will do all I can to track down more clues within the monastery. Although Garrick Mach's library is so... well curated, I doubt any further records will be found. Wondrous! We shall do all that we can as well! Okay... So the... Um, over... overarching... 
motive of this, I guess, to be the quest for a resurrection chalice. <clears throat> <clears throat> Excuse me. All right, sort of creator is restored, so it's every uh, every chapter gives five. Because we completely broke it last chapter with how many things there were, um, and now it's back up to five uses. So maybe we'll try to be more conservative for this upcoming chapter. We shall see. Um, but is there anything new on the map by chance? I guess let's at least talk to Alfric together, and then we'll do our typical just... We'll jump cut around, talk to everyone. So, hi. The Ashen Wolves got their name from the beasts who guard the Blue Sea Star. The Archbishop named the house herself, in fact. In spite of that, it seems she looks unfavorably upon our house of late. This saddens me greatly. Interesting. Um... Okay, I wasn't sure if he, it was anything super important or not. Hopefully that doesn't happen again. I did just get a new capture card, and uh, it has not been playing nicely. Okay. <laughs> I've only had the chance to speak with Elfric briefly, but he seems like a respectable man. It's obvious the whole town has a lot of affection for him. Kind of reminds me of Lenato in that way. I've got a lot of time on my hands down here, so I've been venturing even deeper underground. This place is loaded with winding paths and blocked off tunnels. It's a real maze. Only a few folks even know how to operate the gate mechanisms and hidden passages. That's what I said. Activate the mechanism and the gate slams shut. Bang! Actually, I'll level with you. Yuri and Constance are much better at scoping out that kind of thing. <laughs> I heard Alfred came to Yuri's rescue in the attack that happened recently. That's just what you'd expect from someone as kind and strong as he is. I can't believe he's single. Had a chance to poke your head in here, Professor? It's a fortune teller's room. Judging by all her mystical looking doodads, I think she's the real deal, too. I wonder if she does matchmaking. Maybe she can help me sort through my countless suitors. Abyss is a sprawling place. Some houses, like mine, are actually quite far from the center of town. What brings me all the way here, then, you ask? I came to see Elfric. Even a glimpse of him is said to bring good luck. Don't annoy Happy, or make her feel disappointed. You mustn't. Not ever. Okay? Sometimes, Elfric gives out candy. Stick close by him, and you might get some, too. But save a little for me, okay? Well, well. The Imperial Princess, the Crown Prince, and the next Sovereign Duke. Must be exhausting trying to suss out each other's intentions, huh? Nah, we get along great. I mean, we kind of have no choice. A petty squabble could start an all-out war. And it doesn't take a fancy title to have a hidden agenda. Isn't that right, Yuri? Cheeky. And off base. What do you think, friend? Do you think I'm off plotting nefarious deeds? <laughs> Not very perceptive, are we? Even so, that's a bit much, wouldn't you say? I do what I need to get by. Nothing more than that. As for the others, they've all got their own struggles. But they're nothing if not trustworthy. Humbling yourself while promoting your friends. Gotta say, I don't hate this side of you. Seems we're a mutual neutrality of one another. I like that you keep your cards close. We'll get along just fine, you and I. Hey you, listen up. I've got something to report. The bandit sightings have stopped, for now. I still won't let my guard down, though. What else? Notice how everyone's in high spirits? Know why? I do. It's because Master Elfric is here. He's real special, that one. He saved my life and lots of others here, too. He's earned some hero worship. Four apostles. God, this is killing me. I'm on the verge of remembering something. I can't shake the feeling that one of their names is also a food or something. The record should be here some... Oh, <laughs> hello, Professor. It's good that you've come. I realized that I missed an opportunity to congratulate myself on my military achievements. But now that you're here, I have an audience for it. Indulge me, won't you? 
<laughs> Behold, the proof that the utmost honor in combat belongs to none other than I, Constance Von Nouvelle. What a relief to get that off my chest. Now, where did Alfred get to? I must have words with him. Pardon the odd question, but something has been bothering me for a while now. Your hair. Was it always that color? That is an odd question. But yes, if you must know, it was a different color when I was a child. How could you know that? Is it possible that we met before the Academy? It's... A long story. Now is not the time or place. Yes, of course. My apologies. There was a time when I did much fighting. Then I was captured. Then I escaped. My home is far away now. My mother is waiting for me. But returning is... It is far away. I worry that I will be here until I am very old. Don't suppose you're here for a drink, huh? They aren't any better, I'll tell you right now. Maybe folks down here wouldn't be so awful if they could get their hands on something worth tasting. Who oh, am I kidding? Nobles are just as bad. For folks who've lost their homes on the surface, Abyss is all they've got. The place used to be nothing more than a den of criminals who did whatever they pleased. Now, we got Elfric to keep an eye on things. He understands that keeping people fed's the way to keep them calm. You've only been on the job a few moons, huh? No wonder you don't come off as a mindless church flunky. Plus, you don't flap your trap all the time. I appreciate that. I hope you never change, no matter how many years you spend with the annoying people up there. Hey, I did outfitting and all that, addressed all the things we had. The one thing I don't know, um, because there's no... As far as I can see, there's no, like, class changing. There's just reclassing what we already have. So the fact that I stole that Dark Seal from the Death Knight, I don't know if we can actually do anything with that. And it only sells... Welcome. We're really broke, by the way. Uh, it only sells for 100 gold. So... Come back soon. I'm not sure if that'll have use or if it's just, hey, you stole that, have 300 gold. Either way, let's get it going. Let's see what is uh, going to be our fight today. Uh, yeah, right here. Let's see what our fight is going to be today. Search for the chalice. Okay, I'm getting right to it. The answer is no. I will not allow it. It is far too dangerous. Ah, but if we can determine its origin, we may eliminate the very danger that vexes you. You already know this, but there are plenty of folks down here who can't defend themselves. If these attacks keep up, eventually they'll find themselves in harm's way. <sighs> yes, I am aware. However, for the time being, you must promise to refrain from acting recklessly. My dear Fluck has suffered enough as it is. You needn't take any further risks. Surprisingly overbearing, isn't he? He must really care about you guys. I don't think that's it. Most certainly. Yet, if we fail to nip this problem in the bud, I shudder to think what will transpire. Fun fact, until like a year or two ago, I always thought the saying was nip it in the butt. I never knew it was a, a flower metaphor. <laughs> like nip it in the bud. I thought it was butt. So, there's your whole new trivia of the day. <laughs> Aha! It's you! In the nick of time, as it were. Come, let us venture into the deep, deep underground. The chalice of legend awaits! Uh... We're going under... Oh, aren't we already underground? But... But of course! Deeper and deeper still beneath the monastery to the chasm of the bound. Coco, you didn't hear a word Elfie said, did you? I surely did, but we must read between the lines. Elfric wants a solution as badly as we do. And so, we shall seek out the Chalice of Beginnings and present it to the church. If our enemies desire the object, this should halt all future attacks on Abyss. <laughs> Brilliant, Present it no? to the church to say, hey, let's wage war underground and take it. 
Uh, I don't know about that that last bit, Constance. I'm not so sure about that. According to legend, there's some kind of binding that protects it from would-be thieves. Even if we find it, we can't just walk up and take it unless we figure out how to break that thing. Ah, but that is simplicity itself. We shall first ascertain whether it is still bound, and then we shall release it. But where is this chasm, anyway? I've never even heard of the place, much less seen it. As luck would have it, I have discovered yet another secret passage. It appears to go deep underground. According to my superior instincts, it undoubtedly leads to the chasm of the bound. Yeah, or like a pit of monsters. Huh. I suppose it's worth <laughs> luck. I don't care about finding some old cup, but if it could help us protect the best, I'll support the cause. You surface dwellers do not have anything else to do at present, do you? You'll assist us, will you not? Uh, we're busy, very busy. We'll go. <laughs> I want to know the response. We're busy. Come on, Teach. We got plenty of time to follow them down that deep, dark tunnel. Admit it. Personally, you're right. I'm dying to find out more about this chasm and chalice business. <laughs> Splendid. It is decided. We leave at once. Okay. <sighs> Feeling pretty lost right now. How long have we been walking? I'm guessing a full week. <laughs> a week? Ridiculous. It's been a few hours at most. Exaggerations aside, if this takes much longer, I'm concerned about our lack of food and water. She's got a point. How about we trek a bit farther, and if we don't find anything, we turn back. Constance, I find it rather curious how quickly you became fixated on the chalice. Care to explain? Oh, I... No, why would I be fixated on a silly little legend for some supposed ulterior motive? <laughs> <laughs> you want the esteem. You think this will convince the church to help you restore your fallen house. Mm. Oh, how could you possibly know that? <gasps> Have you been snooping within the confines of my very mind? Yes, he's a, he's a, he's a mind slayer. Or flayer. <laughs> I shall restore House Nouvelle to its former glory at all costs. <laughs> it's practically a catchphrase. Aha! Uh -huh. Just as I suspected, Constance is the former lady of House Nouvelle. Linhart. I guess it was he not around any time she mentioned her name. I. You know House Nouvelle? In a sense. Until just a few years ago, it was a house of Viscounts in the west of the Empire. House Nouvelle lost its status five years ago, as a result of their part in the war. Huh. You speak as though it has nothing to do with you. I fear all I can do is ask forgiveness in place of my useless father. If doing so will comfort you in any way, then please accept my... Save your breath. That will not be necessary. There is only one thing that I desire. For the sake of my parents, who fell courageously and selflessly in defense of the Empire. For them, I shall restore our status, revive House Nouvelle, and return it to its former glory. All that I do, even spending each day advancing my magical prowess, is to that end. And in reward for all that hard work, you were forced to live underground. Life's cruel. It's like you took a shortcut back to the starting line. Or maybe you're just unlucky. What are you saying? I never intended to share that side of me with you. Look at that. It's a good thing we didn't turn back. That looks mighty chasm-like if you ask me. There we go. Say, are we beneath the bridge in the monastery? Incredible. Huh. I never thought I'd be gazing up at that bridge we've crossed a thousand times from way, way down below. Are we sure this is the right place? It is. I think. I believe. I hope. Constance, why are you hiding in the shade? Aren't you the one who insisted that we find the chalice? <laughs> the sun, it burns! <sighs> Fine. If you insist that I join you, then I shall. Satisfied? Oh my, I was quite rude just now. 
please accept my humble apologies for treating you so foully? I presume too much to stand beside such noble paragons. Allow me to dig a hole to bury myself in. Uh, no matter how deep underground we are, I guess sunlight is still sunlight. Or constants. What's going on? <laughs> this is what Coco is like in the sun. That's why she lives underground. I fear I cannot guarantee that this is the chasm of the bound. I have almost surely wasted our time. I feel that. Like, fuck the sun. That shit takes, like, all my energy away. But <laughs> put yourself down, yeah? Just put one foot in front of the other. We'll have you back in the shadows before you know it. Cheer up, Coco. We need you. And now I have forced you into a state of pity. I feel so very worthless. I admit, I have never seen anything quite like this before. Is there nothing we can do to help? Abby, keep Constance moving. If we don't start searching, we'll never find that damn chalice. Fine, I'll just push her a bit, I guess. I must ask you to cease. You shall soil your hands upon my filthy back. No soap could possibly... Huh? This feeling. I sense magic in the air. There is something just ahead. The binding spell, perhaps. I don't feel anything at all. Wait. Actually, I hear something. Something big. And it's moving. Oh, was I, was I right about the monster pit joke? Perhaps there is something in place that is guarding the chalice. Yikes. What is that thing? It's like some kind of gigantic toy. I don't have the slightest idea what's going on. But I know it doesn't bode well. I don't know. Could be fun. It's been a while since I've met an enemy that could put up a good fight. Hey, you. It's your master, pal. I'm going to pummel you into my own personal shield. Okay. You know what's interesting? Because I, I still have this, this graphic up. Um, the crest that Constance has is associated with the Bloom Dragon. Which to me sounds like something sun-related. But the sun... <laughs> the sun fucks her up. Small little detail. Okay. What do we got going on here? That's more than just one one robot boy. Uh, okay. There's a lot here. Oh my. Find the chalice. There are three magic seals. A sealed device that requires the spell break key to activate. Okay. Interesting. Boolean. Lance of Light. Let's just go through another Boolean. I kind of hope there's nothing to steal here because I want to use Trickster and not Thief Fury. Another Vulnerary. I can steal a Leather Shield, but I think I'll pass on that. Another Droppable Boolean. Boolean. Okay. Interesting. This one has a boss, like a commander thing on it. That one does two. Interesting. Okay. Well, um, the one thing with with how last map went, I think I'm gonna reclass. Uh, Linhart back to a bishop. Solely, he does drop, is it one magic? Yeah. Uh, but solely for the times two white magic uses and the extra heal. Like, he he did pretty decent damage. Um, but when it came down to it, another we really day, lacked some, outfit. some extra healing. And I know a lot of it was because Yuri was a thief and not a trickster. So, because he, he can also heal. But... Having that extra heal boost should be pretty nice. 
Um, but beyond that, I think we're just gonna get it going. Find the chalice. What's the deal? No matter how many we squash, more just take their place. Hmm. If those things were created to protect the chalice, there must be a way to deactivate them. If I may presume to offer my opinion, the statues may warrant scrutiny. Yeah, yeah, they needed some sort of key. Oh, look at the thing on the wall. That's four mm. crests on it? There must be a way to activate those things. I bet they require some type of key. You who defile this sacred place, leave now or perish. You speak? Marcel? Sacred place? Sounds like the chasm of the bound, all right. I think I might have found the key. That thing over there is carrying it around. Okay. Well, good to know. Um, before all that, though, I want to get some, ready and willing. Get some numbers out here. All right. Uh, do these count as monster? Yes. Okay. Well. The sun. No, 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 not a bolting. They're Lance of Light. Okay, so they are gonna retaliate, of course. I'll give it my all. Well, to most things. We can Dead Eye. Help uh, break open a side. Over here. Uh, can I curve shot from? No. Yep. Happy can reach, though. Okay, there we go. That opens... It says three HP bars. Uh, luckily, it doesn't seem to do a whole lot of damage. Or, oh, Lance of Light. Oh, it's magic weapon. Okay. So doing magic damage, that's why. For that guy, yeah. <laughs> that guy's a problem. I'll cut through. Okay. Hmm. Um. Quite helpful. Maybe I did want to move people around more. I figured we were just fine. Just be whatever. But. Time is now. I wanted to stop all them. Dimitri level 24. I'm getting stronger. I can feel it. Very nice. Very nice. So being able to wield that, uh. Okay, yeah, he's fine. Being able to wield that. What is the crescent sickle? I will Immediately prepare. is pretty awesome. Let's see. What were your... Sure okay. thing. Well, that's like a foul play thing. You don't have a hand axe, okay. So... I mean, that does take one out. Just poke away at this one. Yeah, I think this is going to be a pretty passive first turn. Heal. Oh, he's missing. Oh, one HP. I was going to say, wait a second. Uh, and everyone Stay else, focused. yeah, just get over here in prep to, uh, to deal with anything that's about to walk my way. And Constance... Seven, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I mean, she has res. So she shouldn't really need to fear the damage. Yeah, we'll we'll break the first HP bar.
Now it has Sword Breaker. That's fine. Who, me? He'll, he'll go over here. Okay. Some fancy animation, though. I like the Light Lance animation. Of course, it hit the 59. We at least were able to dodge that, and I didn't realize it was a death, so it had that crit. That's terrifying. Okay, let's see. Ooh. We are going to combat our the mini bow to break that corner and then cancel over here. Uh, okay. So what What else does it get? Sword Breaker and then Magic plus two. All right. Fire on that one. I would like to break it, get more materials. Cause I may be broke with money. Um, we're also not exactly wealthy with repair materials either. Well, that didn't break, even though it was a double. Okay. I, I, oh, sure, sure. Uh, I don't want to waste. Hmm. Linhart. Okay. There we go. Twenty-three. Magic. It's Luck simple. res charm. Sure. With the tile broken, and now it's on its final HP bar. We also need to take care of that. Before it's too late. Um, three uses or two uses? Or we just use Edelgard. Steel Axe is a one-shot. There's 24. Oh, that's a, a still random magic. Oh, she actually has a, uh, an okay magic growth. Oh, an armor slayer. I didn't even notice. Uh, oh, did she miss the first time? God damn it, Edelgard. Let's see, why'd she take damage? That probably a problem. We're gonna do damage here. Oh, I didn't even realize I was there. Okay. Um, and then for the final hit. Uh, I need to be careful with how I do this. I think I want to go here. Uh, swap to a sword. Take out this guy. Use I missed my 70, and now I'm probably going to die. Fantastic. Over here, assist, recover, uh, Hilda. I did pick up that Venom Land or Axe. You lost to me. I'm still a Del. Dex is valuable, but you know. Uh, okay, my asthma. We're gonna get hit. But that breaks it. Mithril. Okay. okay combat arts, new Miguel. It needs more damage. Okay, and then we need to take you down. And this still might go south. Okay, Dimitri doesn't kill, so we're good. All right. Making that super uncomfortable, though. Don't like that. Uh, 
Claude can run in here, mini bow. Never underestimate an outsider. And then who else is like who's our lowest level? I think it's Yuri actually. Yeah. So, Yuri, I did give him a eleven sword. Don't Splurged a bit. I'll never be satisfied. Because sword breaker. Very tempting though. So let's see. For the kill, Ash. Founder, no. I guess Constance. Yes. So it does magic damage, but uh, it doesn't have much res. I sped a seemingly. To their demise. Unless that was also part of the buff. Also, oh, yeah, we're outside, so she has the defense res buff. Okay. Heal. Uh, we'll heal Happy. Alright, so Swordbreaker. Mr. Golem. I mean, are you really any different than the other ones? 18 attack, 23 magic. Uh,. 22 magic, slightly stronger. Silver Lance. Okay. Dimitri's defense, 22. I don't know that I really want. Think this through. Anything to tank this turn? I'll cut through. Let's just kind of set up. Maybe something will I mean, Byleth probably can actually just kind of chill here. I know, you know, Sword Breaker and all, but it gets shit moving. I have held back. That uh that was very fortunate. <laughs> I did not expect I should have I should have checked how much damage it really had. 46 attack compared to 32. Yeah, wait, so Lance of Light plus versus Le Okay, that's the difference. I was looking at the magic stat comparatively. It's 28. I think I read that as 23 as well. So Yeah, you, you just just a smidge terrifying. Just a wee bit there. Uh, what kind of shapes we got? I think Edelgard has the the flames. We won't hold back. We do need to kind of watch for that. Uh, okay, and then Ash. Someone. Even thinking of the group flames. Those are the same shape as Bo. Yeah, all right, group flames. Happy can reach with group flames. Uh, not where I want, apparently. Gotta go right here for that. Zero damage, but it would break. So I don't need damage. As long as it breaks, five mithril. All right, and now we bully. So let's go here with Ash. Do a steal. Uh, two chances for crits versus one. No crits, okay. Rusted sword. Uh, so anti-monster, bane of monsters. Good monster breaker. Uh, Monster Blaster. Monster Piercer. There we go. Alright, Combat Arts. Monster Piercer. Iron Lance Plus. Do I need to use the Crescent Sickle? Oh, even 
then we'll do enough. Do you... You have Night Healer and Helm Splitter. Can we... Well, then an axe. We back away. We have the poison, which I believe stays between HP charges. Okay. Um, so the rest of it... What is Yuri got? Nothing specific to... Hey, you are bulky. God damn. Okay, Iron Lance. I don't need the Monster Breaker. 25 for Dimitri. I must keep aiming higher. Dex, defense, res, sure. Okay, now I have Sword Breaker. Let's come in here with a monster blast with iron bow plus damage still not great it gets called to 25 I'm not done yet the magic I could do without people but all right so uh, maybe a rally Hold on we have other healers around All this, we're gonna get we're gonna strength rally. Well done. And let's see here. Shout out Kira's Bane of Monsters, 28 with 43 percent crit, or 34, both with 33 percent crit. Can we? No hesitation. Hey, okay. Well, 28. Such power dwells within. Fantastic level. All right, and now you have Lance Fair. Oh Jesus! Okay. Bulvater eighteen thirty or twenty six. Thirteen times two. Twelve percent crit. Will Physic, Edelgard, and yeah, like, it's not worth attacking you. So we will recover by left and just sit tight. Another one. Okay, that poison helping. So let's I see here. Prevail. Combat Arts. Monster Breaker, Steel Axe, 42 damage. Okay, so if we can do 13, so we don't have to take counter hit, that would be fantastic. Do you... Oh, the plus is one to three range. We don't have any deaths left. Ugh. But it is big boy. How's a dead eye? Doesn't someone have a rally? You have rally skill. You're a big help. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna try and give this to add rally skill, rally strength. We're gonna come back here, and then we're gonna dead eye. Iron bow. We don't need to even use steel bow. Oh, and we get the crit! Look at you! Now we don't have to use Monster Breaker. Bless! Strength deck. Wow! This Ash is already better than the Ash I used in Blue Lions. Good lord. Okay. Um, let's give... Who wants this kill? Hilda? Bring it in. Bring it home. Uh, I'm all sweaty. Okay, spell break key. Huh. 
There's clearly something special about this key. Better keep it safe. Yeah. So is that like in our inventory? It is. Okay. So there are three things in the back that we have to reach now. There's a lot to get there. Uh, there's this heel tile. Constance. Item. Uh, let's do fire. Wait. Experience. Doesn't quite push her all the way up. Uh, there we go. Uh huh. There's a dude behind us that's just slowly making his way toward us. Uh, Yuri. Over here. And heal. Okay. As far as these guys go. Silver Lance. Is there like a. Yaha. Uh -huh. Okay. Do. I, I don't want to break that. I mean, it's still 40. So we're good. 12 attack speed. Yeah. That should be good. There's something like... Oh. We dodge 81s, but can't dodge like 60s. There's still something I don't trust about this. So I just realized these are phantom soldiers. Nice vulnerary. I just realized there's another big boy right here. Simone! Huh. Okay. I need to be cautious of that. Let's get Mithra every time we break them. What's, what's being highlighted? Oh, you. Okay, I was going to say, there's, there's something that I'm not seeing right now. Anything? I'll, I'll just double up. All right. As much as that mithril would be nice, there are things coming my way. I don't think I can stop and grab the mithril every time. Especially with how much there is around. Okay. It's a Yuri. A sword breaker. Uh, over here. Well, I mean, it's better than nothing, I guess. Them having sword breaker really kind of sucks. <laughs> nothing happened. Wait a minute. Oh, wait. No, did he get, like, massive crits? It's on his last HP bar. Okay. Uh, it's like, I, I just instinctively skip a lot because I pretty much know what's gonna happen. Uh, except for, you know, when I miss and just become upset. <laughs> uh, let's see, can we kill with just one person? Uh, potentially. Ah, no crit, okay. That's fine. Uh, Hilda, hand axe. You lost to me. So, 24. Oh dear, maybe I was. Okay. Could be worse. Could be worse. Well done. And rally your skill just because. Come in here. Uh, how much HP you got? Oh, you're you're full HP. Well, Iron Axe it is. Alright, over here. Assassins would like to... I don't want to pull them into the thicket. But 
But as far as people who have moved already, not a whole lot of choice, seemingly. Uh, I mean, Claude, what's your speed? 24, 24 attack speed, their speed, 26. I'm not gonna be doubled. What is your rally? Oh, I could rally. Oh, magic res. Eh. We're fine. I just want them to start moving. Get them in here. Dish some damage. So we don't have to worry about them and the giant robots at the same time. And space that a bit. Okay. So, all this. And then, uh. There we go. Constance level 23. The music makes us seem. Doubtless, oh, this is a I think it's it's the, the music here. We go from the, the Abyss theme to this just kind of slow burn, quiet. And it's unsettling, honestly. Uh, oh, we are getting the buff from Hilda. I could rally his strength again, which I think I will. Much appreciated. That's how it goes. There we go. Okay, so that's down. So now we got you coming to say hi. What do you want to do? You want to kill Claude? Got it. Well. It's your call. Claude, move back here. We'll concoction. I want to hit by left. I think we're just back all the way. Gonna hit Ash, which is fine. Um, I do kind of want to. I don't know if that's too much. It's probably fine. How much attack before I do this? 41? Oh. I mean, we'll live it. It's gonna hurt, but we'll live it. Just clear more things out of the way. Yeah. That should pull the other armor. Bop. So very respectable. Oh, we still had the, the rally strength up, right? All right, so... Maybe I shouldn't have pulled these because this guy's still here. <laughs> hmm. Okay, this is gonna be another, like, I... Which shapes we got. I was like, someone else has a, has a large shape. It's Yuri. Gambit. From here. I've got a mace up my sleeve. Um actually let's go back into the forest. Okay. So two Dimitri, I think, can finish the job while breaking another. Back over here. And then Lynn. Pretty decent. One mithril there. Can't all be winners. Okay. Ready and willing. So Claude. He's only 15 HP left. Let's see. Constance. 
Take out another HP bar there. Fly away. And then you have the final one there. Um, I think Happy has to take out this guy. Nighty night. But what is the bow? There's a bow down. Sword down. I'm not sure. This, uh, this is an axe down. Oh, well, there we go. You know your limits. 25 for Edelgard. It's a long road yet. Yeah, that was great. That was great. Uh, <laughs> I wish I could say it was. I really do. He wants to attack Edelgard now. Okay. Let's go over here, Iron Bow. Oh. Let's come over here and mace to the face. Anyway, sorry, but victory is mine. Okay, so now I'm also hit Edelgard for 16. I mean, could be worse. And I'm thinking. I want to get. Retribution in here? We'll do it on Byleth. Retribution on Linhart doesn't really do anything for us. But those four, Dimitri, Edelgard, Balthus, and Byleth. You know what? Let's get Hilda in on the on the retribution. So we'll do it here, Gambit. Going. That way, we can retaliate on this thing attacking Edelgard. Alright. Come in here. Fire. Doesn't quite kill. Uh, but Yuri. There we go. They're so res heavy. Yuri doesn't actually have a whole lot of use against all this. Um, there we go. There's a break. We have three making their way. The main thing I think I need to watch out for. Make sure I don't get hit by yep. Yeah, hit by the horses without realizing it. Oh, that's a nasty tile. Okay. I was wondering if I could just get them to move in. Not comfortably. Ben and Axe. Let's go Steel Axe. Do a nice chunk. Break a shield. Oh, hi. That's fine. That is fine. Okay, Happy. And last HP bar. Let's come in. Balthus, maybe? No, no, no. Well, I mean. Yeah, I, I think I want. Yeah. It'd be great if we dodged the 60. But we don't. Okay. 28, 25, 24, 20. This ash is very helpful. Kind of insane. There's a very night and day difference between the Ash I had. So I didn't really, I was like, oh great, we have Ash. Linhard is at least utility, uh, but he's pretty decent on damage so far. And then Hilda's, Hilda's great. But can't say I, I expected this out of uh, this group anyways. Mm. Oh wait, hello. Whoa. What do you have? Oh, Vulnerary. Let's not pull too much. Hi. Like, it's been a hot minute since they uh, spawned more. Now this one, Horse Slayers. Glad I actually looked at what they had, <laughs> because 
Oh boy. Steel Axe perfectly takes that down. We need to break more. Yuri. Break it, please. Oh, I just realized why Happy, even though it does magic, or has magic, does so much damage to him. She has the monster killer um, pa uh, as her personal. That's what it is. So 23. Could have been better. Oh. Been worse. Definitely could have been worse. That was nice. You're one strength away from getting a, a weight. Weight decrease. Before that, let's see. 25, 24, 28, 25. We'll kill with Linhart. At least this HP bar. Oh, we will eviscerate <laughs> with Linhart. And then. That's such good damage. That's from Bulbature. Uh, I'm gonna go with Sagitte. I don't want to use Fumbulvatar quite yet. Uh, Claude. It was a good try. kill. It's your call. Go back and heal. As for you, okay. So three things are about to attack Edelgard, huh? That's fine. Okay. Okay, I was gonna say, as long as we hit the, the 68s, we're gonna be in good shape. Oh, more dex, more strength, okay. Put that. Now hit the 69s. Oh my. Ready and <laughs> Can't say, uh, I thought that was gonna happen. Uh, okay. Well, Yuri. Oh, you are out of those Ratus, huh? I guess that's fine. I just need to break a corner. I like big boy number two, Simone. Just to make sure. Okay. Uh, is Linhardt still. Oh, Constance is also kind of down here. But, there we go. Linhardt 24. What you got for me, bud? Speed and luck? For, for you, that's not great. Speed, you know, hard to be mad at speed. But, uh, in this circumstance. Where's Balthus? Can we take you out with some punches? Yes. And then we will do the rest with Happy. Or a chunk with Happy. No, maybe not the rest. Up here. Constance can maybe sagitate now. I sped a weakling to their demise. Worry not. Okay. I feel like as long as the this boss is gone, we're gonna be in pretty good shape. You, okay, Braxis hurts, but you don't share the same. That's all I cared about. Uh, okay, we're gonna go here. This is going to hurt Dimitri. I really wanna do that. Again, it's you, 45 attack. 45 minus 16. It does have the res buff. Uh, still hurts, not fun. Uh, what's your attack speed? So I know what I want to equip. 13, 
So I need... Okay, 18 will double in return. That's exactly what I want. Full concoction. Make sure we have full health. All right. Time to take on Simone. Something about this. After last chapter, it don't feel right. It's, it's a slow-moving one. That's for damn sure. But... I don't trust. Did say don't trust, and uh, seems like I was in the right. <laughs> Okay. How to kill you. That's a problem. Um I'll highlight you. Highlight you. Okay, I think what we're gonna need here is Banshee. Maybe I just need to run back. I'm afraid more are gonna pop up. Just need the break. Just kind of go all in with Violet. Oh God, you're terrifying. Um, shapes. He. Simone requires being broken. Use caution. A gambit here. And what I could do then... Yuri, we're going to recover Constance. Over here. The sun. You're, you have how much movement? Seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Perfect. Gambit. We have assembly. Oh, oh, Happy needs a shit. Well, I guess that's also fine. You say so. I thought she had. Did she miss? Nothing changed. God. What's your gambit? Assembly. Oh, I got it. There we go. I know that pulls forward, which actually helps me. Okay. Ash. Mini bow. Make sure my cursor. I want to hit right there. 25 for the boy. Is this a. Okay. And then final one. Can I hit from here? A death. I can. I can touch it. <laughs> Herb shot. Okay. There's the break. Five mithril. We back away. Um. And now we see what we can get accomplished. Stay there. You don't have range. We're gonna heal Balthus. We're going to Numagale. 
Okay, there we go. So one HP bar. Can't wait for my next brawl. Well, speed. Okay, combat arts, monster breakers, steel axe. That was a crit. One step at There's a time. no other way we just got a hundred experience. Good fucking job. All right. Yeah, the reinforcements are coming to say hi. At least they're not same turn. At the very least. Hello? Bop, bop. So let's see. We still need to do a full thing. Swarm, Swarm Z. Yes. Sure. Um, three assassins behind us are also an issue, for sure, but I think I can deal with that. Uh, maybe not. Because I can't get here to stop two of them with a gambit. You don't have a gambit. Yours is broken. Onslaught does what? Is that a push? Push. Okay. Is Retribution still active? No, it just wore off. Not good. that Constance does. This is a problem. Oh my god. Uh, I guess I gotta... I gotta go for... Thank you! Like, I gotta go for broke on some of these. So this is what that was a terrible level. Truly amazing. Don't... Don't even, Lynn. <laughs> I don't need your sass right now. That was god-awful. Uh, okay. So there we go. There's that dealt with. We still need to get this. We're gonna, we're gonna smash your problem because of Brax. Uh, actually, it doesn't do as much as I thought it would. But I do think I gambit here. Thanks, Bill. Now, Yuri... Eleven sword. Okay, that sword breaker. Hilda. Does Hilda have no oh, night healer? Okay. Uh, steel axe times two. I mean, sure. Fifty-three hit shouldn't hit me, but if it does, we'll be okay. Okay. I'm glad it didn't. So with that, uh, Dimitri is not looking too great right now. Okay, I can take an HP bar away from you. I can definitely kill Simone. That much is certain. Can 
They're wanting to attack Yuri. No, Edelgard just... Do the business... Uh, minor Crescent Arrows, never mind. <laughs> I was like, no, that's 45, not 48. Okay. It still wants to attack you, which is perfectly fine. Come over here. Finish that HP bar, Javelin. Slow and. I will come back here. He won't kill, even if I don't heal him. Okay, that's good to know. Let's do a monster blast. Or not. You know, Balthus, we're going in with you. I want nothing to do with this dude right here. Store, huh? It's like they they hurt. Can't deny that. Like this guy's gonna gonna blow up the ground. And that's gonna be kind of an issue too. I don't know how to calc that damage though. Like I don't know if they're oh oh okay, so it it's a gambit. Played how many hours of this game? Just learned that. <laughs> 15 my okay it's gonna hurt staggering blow oh and it show okay 36 attack is what it's gonna do <sighs> for good measure I want you to full HP that might still not be enough come over here heal you that's for certain Okay. I think we're good. Yeah, this guy is still just... We taunted him at the start. Oh, hi. It's because I killed the boss. They are... Over already. So for all the, the shitty hit rates that, are, have, that have been happening, we've been counterbalancing those by getting some really nice crits. Okay. Pain. Lots of pain. Sure, pal. But it didn't put disturbance on. God, we're surrounded by those. <laughs> Okay, uh, come over here. Iron sword, you did take you. Uh, this sniper. Let's just forget about him. Everyone else. Uh, okay, we're gonna come up, say hi. This one's gonna explode. So, come over here. There we go. We're just going. Going for for a break here. Come up here. She does not have very many tomes. Actually, with how much damage you're gonna do, let's do a double Sagittate on the one here. Back away. Happy. Can't kill you, huh? Well, Happy can um, take an HP bar away from you. We might have gone a little too thin here. We might have an issue. A fairly large issue here in a second. <laughs> Hilda straight up takes you out. Uh, and then we can Kanto back over here. And then can we monster break? Kill. Okay. 
I'll cut through. Dimitri. Use caution. Oh man. Um combat arts, monster blast. Yeah. My moment has arrived. Yes. Sorry, but victory is mine. Like I was saying about the clutch crit. <laughs> oh my god, in that level. Can always depend on you. Oh my god, that level. Uh, okay. So we still have to take out another HP bar um, from this guy. We're gonna Thanks. Him. Currently, he wants to attack Happy, which he's not gonna kill. So I feel like he's fine to do so. Uh, I can onslaught, which I am going to do, just so he wants to target both. Which actually, maybe that's uh. He does actually kill. <laughs> Just realized. <laughs> that was not a smart idea. Monster Breaker. You don't have a gamble. Wait, wait, wait. How much? Your defeat was inevitable. Strength, speed, strong. defense. We can breathe. Predictable. Good, good. Well, that one. The one in the back has a gambit. Let the lesson be oh my god. To grow. Good lord. Strength, no. speed. He's like, yeah, he's gonna go for the gambit, otherwise, he'll die. Oh, the 35, you hit that? That actually might be kind of a problem. I think someone has restore. Linhart does. Can I restore from here? Yes. Okay. Price is averted. So... Take out the sniper. Take the vulnerary. Uh, happy. Come on, let's highlight both warriors, just so I know where ha Ooh, Happy is not safe in many places. But I will use death for this, just to get him out. Okay, this one still full up. Let him attack Claude. Okay. We didn't get anything for... For killing the second one. We just killed it. Let's heal up there. We're going to... Heal both this a bit over here. Uh, both this. We're gonna come over here. Items, iron gauntlets, fine. Healing focus. I'll cut through. I'm wondering if we have to visit all three of them, and by visiting one, I'm anticipating reinforcements. Like we, it looks like we're home free at this point. You fuck well, but I don't believe it. I really don't. What is that? But at the very least, while we may not believe it, we're able to oh, look at you. Not able to kill. But that's respectable.
Okay, we'll come in here. No crit, damn. Well, 23 for Yuri. I'll never be satisfied. Okay. Let's see. This guy's gonna blow up, so. Bring Ash over here, mini bow, take out the low HP. That was tough. And then anyone like really close to a level other than Violet. Oh, happy. Okay, we'll come over here. My asthma kills this guy now. 24. Can we hit 30 magic? Good yeah. for me. Okay, and then Hilda. Let's not risk that. No need to risk that. Uh, I'm all sweaty. Don't expect much more than that. I can appreciate that one. Okay. Now everything else. Constance. Sagitte. Break a corner. And back away. Not. <laughs> I think that was gonna end up rhyming. Um, okay. Up here. Run. And then, yes. Yeah. Last HP bar. Uh, yeah. this There's no way this is gonna kill. <sighs> Poor guy. Like, <laughs> please. Don't forget about me. I still don't trust. So I kind of want to set people up at checkpoints. One tile away. Alright. Uh... Okay. A little bit there. Think this through. Can't kill. Uh, Constance. That's a whole bolt. Fuck it. Two range bolting. Heaven sword. And 24, 28, 26. Balthus. Get over here, bud. At least you're no coward. <sighs> we can breathe. All right, Hilda. Lever. I wonder if it matters if it's that it's on you. Close call, but we did it. Our efforts paid off. <laughs> did they? Was it a... Was it RNG? Did I just happen to pick the first one? Or the right one? Okay, we'll take that. 18 turns, goddamn. Again, long map. MVP getting an experience boost. Ten smithing stone. There's something drawn on the rock over there. Yeah. They look like crests. Whoa, what's going on? My crest. Oh, but look at the stone. There's light streaming from it. We're blind. We're saving. Okay. 
But also, it's looking like these episodes are going to do... There's something in that opening. Full chapters, and they're all going to be, I guess, this length? Hope they don't get longer. <laughs> Have a look at the CG. It's like a water... Watercolor E, as opposed to all the other CGs in the game. There's like no uh, no hard outlines. Oh, can it be? Is that? You would know best. It is beyond my ken whether that is the chalice. Curse my ignorance. Answer the question, will ya? Is it or isn't it? That quaking earlier, some kind of containment magic related to the crests was in place here. Whether intentionally or not, the chalice was released. I hesitate to suggest that those things were the cause. Oh, perhaps one of our crests was the key to unbinding the chalice. Care to summarize that? My apologies. I have caused you undue vexation by speaking so incomprehensibly. Were I to venture a tentative guess, I would say that this is indeed the Chalice of Beginnings. You could have just said, this is it, all right. <laughs> Forgotten crests resembling those of the Four Apostles, depicted on a sealed rock wall. Objects that resemble holy armaments, and a chalice that gathers magic all on its own. I don't know of any other legends that cover all of that, so this must be the chalice we're looking for. A thousand thank yous for covering my own inadequacy with such a competent explanation. I'm still not used to hearing you speak in such a manner. Forgive me, your highness. If I have displeased you, please take my life as a small gesture of atonement. Oh, your highest of highnesses, I doth humbly beg of thee to find forgiveness within your royal heart. Stop fooling around, Claude. And Constance, I assure you there is nothing to forgive. Mm -hmm. I hear thunder. Rain is soon to follow. We'd better head back to Abyss before the storm hits us. Ugh, it happened yet again. Why must my good intentions always... Huh? What because was that the, sound? It the clouds be. covered the sun. Wait, cannot be what? Don't- Oh, they're gonna cliffhang! No! God damn it. Well, alright. Chapter 3 down. Fighting a bunch of robots. We were- That was in a... Valley or something. Or giant... I don't know. Some sort of giant crevice under the bridge. But we got the cup. Where things are going to go from here, I'm sure they're just going to escalate. <laughs> but yeah, that's going to be it. Thank you all for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed, and I will see you next time. Bye.